Earth is the planet we live on, and it moves. Um, here, let's use one of Urchin's donut holes. Now, this is Earth, and um, let's use one of these skewers for the imaginary axis that the Earth spins on. Uh, Professor, you just stabbed my breakfast! Oh, you've had quite enough for one morning, thank mm. you, Urchin. Now, the Earth spins around on its axis, around and around. Urchin, where's your uh, emergency flashlight? Oh, right here. Ah, oh, perfect. Now, shine it on, the, uh, on, on here. There we are. Now, Urchin's flashlight is the sun. Now, you see, where the sun shines, or where the light shines, on the donut hole, I, I mean the Earth, it is daytime. Now, you see, there's no light on this side of the Earth, so for everyone on this side of the Earth, it is night. Now, you see, the Earth, each day, the Earth spins around on its axis, around and around, and we face toward and away from the sun for night and day. So each day, it spins one full revolution on its axis. It takes 24 hours for the Earth to go all the way around, and that makes one full day. We go around and around on our axis, how profound. The Earth spins around itself once each day. It's daytime when we face the sun's great light. When we spin a little more, it gets dark. Good night, round and around and around. Now, there's something else in the sky that moves, and it's called the moon. The moon? Yes, the moon. Now, it's a lot smaller than the Earth, but it's a lot closer to us than the sun. Um, close enough for us to have visited it. Yes. Now, um, let's use one of these blueberries to be the moon. And um, <clears throat> let's get one of these toothpicks here. There we are. Right. Now, here is the moon. See? Now, Earth's gravity makes the moon orbit all the way around it. Now, you see, the moon's orbit around the Earth is not a perfect circle, but an ellipse or an oval. Now, you see, the Earth and the moon are attracted to each other like magnets. And that creates tides in the ocean. The moon goes round and around. The Earth we found. It's pulled by the Earth's gravity. The moon enjoys the ride, creating high and low tides. Round and around and around. Now, the moon lights up the sky at night because it reflects the sun's rays. But that's not all. Let's clear a bit of space here. Now, let's make this melon be the sun now. So there is the sun. That's the sun? Yes, that's the sun, Urchin. Hmm. Yes, indeed. So, now the sun stays right where it is. The sun is the centre of our solar system. Solar system? Yes, solar system. Now, the Earth goes all the way around the sun, you see, like the moon goes around us. Now, the Earth's orbit around the sun is not a perfect circle either, but an ellipse like the moon's orbit around us. Now, it takes 365 and a quarter days for the Earth to go all the way around the sun, and that makes one full year. Be careful, Professor. I may want to eat that Earth later. The Earth goes round and around the great sphere we call the sun. It takes a while to travel round that sphere. The sun's gravity helps the Earth on its journey. Once around the sun makes a year. <laughs> if you're done with that donut hole, Professor. Well, actually, Urchin, I think I'm going to need the whole bowl, you see. The whole bowl? The whole bowl, <laughs> because the sun is so big. It holds eight planets, including Earth, in orbits around it. That's what we call our solar system. In the centre of a solar system is the sun. Around and around it we go. The Earth goes around the sun, but we are not the only one. Seven other planets enjoy the fun. First, Mercury. Second, Venus. Third is Earth with our moon close by. Fourth, Mars. 
fifth, Jupiter sixth, Saturn with its rings in the sky, seventh, Uranus, eighth, Neptune, the eight main planets, that's the end of my tune. Now you see, all but Mercury and Venus have moons going around it just like us. Um, Mars and Neptune have two moons each. A big planet like Jupiter has many moons going around him. And Saturn has many moons and rings going around him. Gee, Professor, what about Pluto? Oh, well, you see, Pluto is, was, was made too tiny to be a planet, you see, so they demoted it huh. for being too small. Huh. So here's poor old too tiny Pluto way out on the edge of our solar system. Lovely. And you tell me not to play with my food. Hmm.